Hello, welcome to August 18th, 2023. Uh, it's, a th- it's a Friday. My name is Kurt, and this is my daily good life meditation, an exercise that I do every day, just after I wake up. It's now uh, 4.37 a.m. I do this in order to remember my life objectives and principles, those which are outlined in my book, Going Alone. I also use this time to reflect on the last 24 hours, uh, but in also including last night, how I slept. I uh, then prepare for the coming day by looking forward at what I might anticipate and uh, readying myself for the challenges and opportunities I might, meet, I might meet, and particularly to prepare myself for the unexpected so that I'm ready ready to, uh, keep, to keep my footing uh, in whatever circumstance may come. Uh, and then I ask myself if I'm ready to die, and then I start my day. But before I do all of that, let's uh, read two poems from John Keats. Yesterday's poem, uh, we'll just read that one through without any study, and then we'll study a new poem, and uh, I'll read that too. Yesterday's poem is called, uh, Tis the Witching Time of Night. Tis the witching time of night, orbed is the moon and bright, and the stars, they glisten, glisten, Seeming with bright eyes to listen. For what listen they? For a song and for a charm. See, they glisten in alarm. And the moon is waxing warm to hear what I shall say. Moon, I keep wide thy golden ears. Hearken, stars, and hearken, spheres. Hearken, thou eternal sky. I sing an infant's lullaby, a pretty lullaby. Listen, 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 glisten, 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 and hear my lullaby. Though the rushes that will make its cradle still are in the lake, though the linen then that will be its swathe is on the cotton tree, though the woolen that will keep it warm uh, is on the silly sheep. Listen, stars, light, listen, listen, glisten, 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 and hear my lullaby. Child, I see thee, child, I found thee midst of the quiet all around thee. Child, I see thee, child, I spy thee, and thy mother sweet is nigh thee. Child, I know thee, child, no more, but a poet evermore. See, see, the lyre, the lyre is a flame of fire. Upon the little cradle's top, flaring, 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 past the eyesight's bearing, awake it from its sleep and see if it can keep its eyes upon the blaze. Amaze, amaze, it stares, it stares, it stares. It dares what no one dares. It lifts its hand into the flame, unharmed and on the strings, paddles a little tune and sings with dumb endeavor sweetly. Bard art thou completely, little child, O the western wild, bard art thou completely, sweetly with dumb endeavor, a poet now or never, little child of the western wild, a poet now or never. And I'll confess, this is the second time to read this one. I, I read it and studied it yesterday in the new vocabulary. I This one escapes me. I don't get it. And I'll just leave that at that. Some poems I don't get. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Here's another one. I kind of remember these poems are written in chronological order. So if poem Keats wrote this one next, it seems like he was in the same mood. <laughs> it's called Welcome Joy and Welcome Sorrow. I think this one I get a little better, though. And there's a quote here from Milton. Under the flag of each his faction, they to battle bring their embron atoms. Embron is embr- em- 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 uh, embryonic. There's a couple of words here I had to look up, uh, actually names. Uh, 
Laith is, a, I've, I've encountered this before, but I forgot. It's the river uh, in the afterworld where you drink from the water and you forget. Um, aspics at her breast. I don't know. I looked up aspics. It was some sort of a fruity concoction. I don't know what it is. And then there's a Saturn, which is a, the Roman god of uh, um, renewal and dissolution and um, um, agriculture, a couple of other things. And then uh, Momos is a uh, Greek god of uh, censure. Let's read. <clears throat> welcome joy and welcome sorrow, lathe sweet in Hermes feather. Come today and come tomorrow. I do love you both together. I love to mark sad faces in fair weather and hear a merry laugh amid the thunder. I like those two, right? You see the sad faces in, in good weather and a, la and a merry laugh in thunder. Fair and foul I love together, meadows sweet where flames burn under. Hmm. And a giggle at a wonder, visage sage at pantomime, funeral and steeple chime. Hmm. I like this one, infant playing with a skull. Wow, what imagery. Morning fair and storm-wrecked hull. hull. Wow, a shipwreck on early, beautiful early dawn. You know what, old shipwreck. Nightshade with the woodbine kissing, serpents and red roses hissing. Wow. Cleopatra regal, regal dressed with the aspics at her breast. Ah, yes, aspics. The, the, that's how Cleopatra killed herself, right? She had the poison asp. She had the snake bite her yeah, on, her, on her breast right there. That's what it is. It's a snake. But I had never heard of it as aspics. So it's, 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 it's a contrast of joy and sorrow. Dancing music, dancing music, music sad, both together sane and mad, muses bright and muses pale, somber Saturn, momus hail. Okay, so Saturn, how those contrast, Saturn is Roman, momus is Greek, Greek god of censure, kind of down, and, Mo and Saturn god of renewal. Okay, 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 I see that. Laugh and sigh and laugh again, oh the sweetness of the pain. Muses, bright and muses, pale, barrier faces of the veil. Let me see and let me write of the day and of the night. Both together let me slack my, all my thirst for a sweet heart ache. Let my bower be of you, a type of tree, interwreathed with myrtles new, pines and lime trees full in bloom, and my couch a low grass tomb. I like that last bit, and my couch a low grass tomb. I don't know the contrast. Mm. I'll read it again tomorrow. I get this one better, right? He's just uh, um, enjoying those contrasts of the, uh, of the various things, right? Joy and sorrow. Okay, so uh, let's talk about last night and yesterday. It's not fine last night. Yesterday, good day of work. Uh, no particular challenges, no particular opportunities that I could think of, although I did have some good time with ChatGPT. We, I have been working on, uh, just before I finish my day job, I always give myself a challenge, a business challenge. I wrote an RFQ for uh, to buy a new fire truck, of all things, for a city. That was fun. Went to finish, uh, start to finish in 20 minutes. Good job. I, I mean, good job. I'm not congratulating myself, but it was a good job that ChatGPT did in terms of developing the final document. Um, good job on my part for, you know, facilitating that document by way of the AI. All right, let's do the good life. Seven objectives. To be always ready to die, to make good and effective use of time, to develop and maintain good and sound life principles, to cultivate good emotional reactions, to perform good actions, to recognize true limits and true opportunity, and to do just one thing at a time, and do that thing slowly and deliberately and carefully. 34 principles. War, reason, homunculus, anchor hold, home of good and evil, purpose, atomic principle, Principle of nature, the pirate ride. Maturity, social principle. Family, public speaking. Temperance, life will not go well. The horror show, that which must be born. The feast of Oval, distraction. Agency in the great indifference. See, um, best seat in the house. Restless, the restless man, the path of wildness. The Great Life Adventure. 
the risk of avoiding risk, sin and damnation, complete oblivion, the season of philosophy, script writing, the bullseye aim, the uphill climb, arena and utility, nothing is enough, and the principle of fun. There you go. Felt, felt like I got them all. As for today, um, the day of work, it's Friday. Uh, I'll, care, I'll just carry on. Nice life story. I'm about to enter a segue period, right? Going from this life to uh, life on the road with my dogs and my Prius to a life in Japan. And as for my readiness for death, my uh, affairs are in order, my relationships are sound, and my life's work is done. I'm ready. Should have come today. And with that, I'll stop. I wish you all the best. Be safe, but not too safe. And with that, my life is done, if not finished. I said it backwards, but that works. See ya.